Hey everyone, welcome back to new content of Cybrosis. In today's video, we will discuss about the automation in Odoo project. So Odoo, a comprehensive suite of open source business applications, offers a wide range of automation features that can significantly enhance your project management efficiency. So by automating repetitive tasks and process, you can save time, reduce errors and improve overall productivity. Set up rules to automatically create tasks based on specific events such as when a project stage changes or specific date is reached. So let's see how we are going to manage the automations in Odoo project. So first, here we can just consider an example. Whenever a task is created for a project in new stage, we just need to send an email to the customer. And when the project is moved from the new stage into in progress stage, then the customer need to be added as a follower. So in order to do so, first we just need to configure the outgoing mail. So for that, you can just dive into the general settings of Odoo, where you can just search for outgoing mail. So as you just search for outgoing mail, here you can see that we have enabled the use custom email server. Afterwards, you can choose the outgoing email server. And later on, we can set up an outgoing email server for our database. Here I have given the name of the outgoing mail server as outgoing itself and the authenticate with as users. Later on, we can just set the connection that is the connection encryption as SSL TSA. And here you can see that I have set the SMTP server. So under that, you can set the SMTP server as smtp.gmail.com. And here, as you just choose the SSL TSL, the SMTP port will be automatically configured over here. Now you can set the username as well as password. So if you want to know how to set the outgoing mail server, you can watch the video that we have already published and kindly watch the video and set up the outgoing mail server for your database. Now let me move on to the project module in order to create a project in the, I mean, in order to create a task for my project. So my project is office design where I'm going to create a new task in the stage new. So here we are just going to set an automation that whenever a task is created in stage new, we just need to send the mail to the customer. So first we can just set the automation over it. So here you can just go to the settings of the task and here we can find the automation. So under the automation here, you can see that I have already created an automation that whenever a task is created. So if you want to create a task, you have to choose the model as task. And here we will be triggering upon a task is created in the new stage. And here you can see that um, the records. So if I just want to send this as an email, uh, we can just set likewise or you can just, just send a message or not or anything and later on you can just save this so once you save this we have set the automation for the stage new and let me create a new stage uh i mean a new task over here for the stage um new so i'm going to create uh, a task and let the task title be send invitation and later on here, you can choose the responsible person that is the assignees. So I'm going to choose my assignee as Michelle admin and let me click on edit. So as I just click on edit here, you can see the further details over here, such as uh, the project name, uh, the customer and all. And if you want to make any further changes, you can just change that. And here, as you just get into the internal link of the customer, here we have to set the email of the customer. So whenever we just create a task in stage new, we can say that upon the setup of the automation, the customer will receive a mail. Now let's check the mail. So here you can see the mail and as you just open the mail here, you can see the body over here like sent invitation is the name of the uh, task or that is the title of the task. And this is just sent to the customer with a thank you for your inquiry. If you have any questions, please let us know is the body of this mail. Now let's back uh, to the project module. Now the next role that we just gonna set up is that 
whenever the task is moved from the new stage into the in progress stage then we just need to add the customer as a follower of the task so for that you can just go to the settings of the in progress uh, stage and here under the automations we can simply set the rule so here you can see that we are just going to manage this rule for the model task and uh, the, this will be triggered or the action have to be triggered uh, when the task is in in progress stage so you can set the trigger over here and this is ap applicable for 40 records and here you can see we can just set the action so i have already added the action so uh, when the task is moved from the new stage into the in progress stage here you can see that the action type is set to add the follower so if you want to just do so you can set the followers that to add so afterwards you can just save this now let's back to the uh, office design and here i'm going to change the task from new stage into um, in progress so let me change that and as you just move on to the um, yeah task and here you can see that currently we have three followers over here which means when the task is just moved from uh, the new stage into the in progress stage we have added our customer as our follower as a customer just want to know the progress of the task so it's very easy to manage uh, the automations of any project or you can simply manage the automations of any modules in odoo so that's all for today thank you for watching the video